Sup? It's a hot bar. Oh. I don't see many taxis cruising around Hawaii. Well, people tend to reserve rides from their hotels or catch one at a taxi port. Taxi drivers in Hawaii are generally a pretty friendly, good-natured bunch. Unless they got the lowdown on all the best spots, so feel free to ask them for good tips. Yeah, you're awfully knowledgeable. Almost as if you're a pro driver yourself there, Tony. Yeah, I'm a taxi driver to the pump. I just don't have a car in We're really opening up. Go. Totally.
Hey there. Go.
This guy, got some weirdo crab nerd that strong. Look, whatever, man. Okay, we're leaving. We won't come back to this beach again. Huh? Nancy? Where'd she go? <coughs> Yo, Olivia. Got something that belongs to you. looking for something better. <laughs> the choice is yours in the end, Olivia. Very nice on you, Olivia. A good, honest home. Everyone deserves that. Speaking of, let's head back. <laughs> Do you want to join us? Welcome to the party.
Enjoy this trip. I said leave me alone. <laughs> Come on, babe. Huh? Stop it. Don't touch me. Hey, easy, easy. Don't you want to have some fun? I got a sweet we can share, you know? It's a nice place. Quiet bar without all the tourists. You'll love it, girl. Good for you, but I'm not interested. Let go of me. Ugh, so much for rest and relaxation. Hey, she's not interested. How about you show some respect and go? The hell? What are you, some hero complex white knight? We we're just having a nice little conversation. No cock blockers allowed. Didn't seem very nice to me. Doesn't take a hero to tell you two are scum. Now one more time, let her go. I'm getting pissed off looking at you. Yeah? What you plan on doing about it? Screw it! The girl can wait! Let's rough this brick up first! Woo! You get a try, Mommy. Let's do it! That's kicking time! Here we go. I'm so sorry. Um, thank you for your help. Uh, shitty situation, huh? Guess there are guys like that everywhere. Take care. Honor? Tattoos? Yakuza! By the falling Sakura petals! Whoa! Hey, who are all you people? Onisan! You're the real thing! The modern Japanese samurai! A Japanese samurai? Uh, hey, I'm from Japan, I guess, but I'm no samurai or anything. It's a proud tattoo on your back! A virtuous heart which defends the weak! Surely a man like you embodies the noble samurai spirit. May I ask your name? It's, uh, Ichiban Kasuga. What about you? Oh, how dishonorable of me. I apologize. I'm Nathan, a director at one of our local Hawaiian TV stations. <clears throat> oh, now I get it. This is a TV crew. You guys shooting on location or something? Yes. We seek out Japanese tourists for interviews and travelogues. Just Japanese tourists? Yes. I love Japanese culture. You see? Manga, anime, kabuki. It's the best. That's why I created this show. To talk to real Japanese people. I guess you're like a Japanese otaku, kind of? Yes. And I'll tell you what I'm most interested in. Filmmakers. Kurosawa, Suburaya, Ozu, the most unique visionary directors of their time. I love their work. That seems like you know your stuff. I used to go to this movie theater that showed old classics myself. How oh, Subarashi! I would love to visit that theater one day. You know, in Japan they say, even a chance meeting can create an everlasting bond. Please, Kasuka-san, let me interview you. Imagine the impact it will have on my show to feature such a proud Japanese man as you. Of course, we'll pay you for your time. Please, will you say you'll do it? All right. You sure seem to be passionate about this. I can spare the time. <laughs> Arigato! Now, let's get started while I explain. Please, follow me. 
Um, okay. You honor me, sir. Sure thing. Okay. Um, no.
Hm? What's up? Leave it to me. Um, no. Ha, ha, ha. 
the shit all you got after trampling on someone else's dreams nathan's got more spine than you ever will damn it i won't forget this hey you all right uh, arigato kasuga -san. i knew it from the start you're a japanese hero like in the movies walking with strength but also with restraint willing to fight to help the weak you're just like a real samurai. Compared to you, I'm nothing but dirt. If I couldn't handle such an over-the-top villain like him, I could never be a... a... You're wrong. Uh -huh. Defending something important to you, getting back up after being knocked down, that's what heroes do in the movies. And you just did all that in real life. Nathan, you're a fine samurai. Kasuka-san, 
And hey, you show me a great time today. Hawaii is amazing, but it's nice to meet someone so interested in where I'm from. Just do me a favor and broaden your ideas about Japan a bit more. I guess that's fair. James may be an asshole, but some things he said were true. True enough, anyway. I love Japanese culture and cinema, but I might have been enjoying it on a superficial level. Ninja and samurai sure look cool, but they're not caricatures. They were real. Some had convictions, but they were people. Flaws and all. Making the show, we didn't care about that. We wanted to pretend every Japanese person was some cartoon hero. It was simpler that way, somehow. But watching you just now, Kasuka-san, I can't keep that up in good conscience. When you were fighting to protect me, I was able to look up and see you in silhouette. It was a frame right out of a classic film. You projected strength, mobility, without saying a word. <laughs> Come on. Before, I told you I want to make movies like Kurosawa. The truth is, I was getting close to giving up for good. It would be easy, you know, resigning myself to making small-time TV for the rest of my career. But I can't go back to that after meeting you. Even if it's just me and my friends, I'll create something that makes people feel the way I do. Something true and honest from my heart. I know you can do it. Hang on to that dream and don't take shortcuts. You'll be a great director. Let me know when you're done. I'll be the first in line at the theater. Yes. Arigato gozaimasu. Oh, hey. I promised you some bonus pay, right? Um, I hope this is to your liking. Huh? What is this? Bright yellow sweets, my lord. <laughs> right. The classic samurai bribe. Nathan, I see we are both unscrupulous men. As you say, my lord. chairs for my place. I bet I could slap one together with a little bit of canvas and some wood. Huh? You want to DIY, Tommy? Yeah, I could make most things that you use on the daily, like tables and shelves. Wow, so you're good with your hands. Then can you carve a bear out of wood? Seriously? A wooden bear. I said I make stuff for daily necessities, not trinkets for turrets. But I could take a stab at it. For real? If you ever do, I would proudly put it on display. All right. Finish. 
show, dipshit. You're gonna regret this. Tell me what you got. Ass picking times.
catch you later. Where my friends at? What? Here we go. Let's go. Think you can handle this? Let's go. Hey, you good? Okay. Take this fist and shove it. even stronger now.
See something. Should I open it? Sweet! I guess this container needs more keys than one. Well, it had a lot of good stuff. Hope there's more like it. Hello! Hey! Go. Oh, 
up. Yep. Here, Kasuga san. I hope you enjoy it. Oh, appreciate it. You didn't have to do that. This goes down real smooth. Your coffee's not usually my thing, but I dig the flavor. I'm very happy that you like it. So, uh, is it true you're a comedian? I get how fame can be a hassle. Uh, sorry that I don't recognize you, though. No, that's just fine. It was a long time ago now. I performed as Espresso Mamioka. Back to the grind. Got my 15 minutes after I came up with a catchphrase that caught on. Espresso and mame is Japanese for... What's it in English? Bean? You had a whole coffee comedian thing, huh? <laughs> That's clever. Coffee comedian. Actually, I started in a doubles act with my partner, Americano Serrata. We were Cafe Soramame. We met working part-time in the same coffee shop and ended up writing routines about our mutual love of Java. <sighs> Those were the days. We'd work on our gags all through closing, then head straight to an open mic to perform. But like most comedy acts, we never went further than that. And we were both pretty broke. <laughs> so we went our separate ways, put our energy into other ventures. Didn't see him after that. No. Actually, I saw him once more, had coffee together. <laughs> I really hope he's doing well these days. A shame about the duo. Does that mean that this back to the grind line was something you came up with on your own? We did it together originally, but it only went viral after some old videos got shared after we broke up. They showed me, so I got the credit. But before I knew it, my moment was over. My agency dropped me based on the accusation I'd done underworld work. It wasn't true. Those guys were saying something like that before, weren't they? Something about shady gigs? There are different kinds, but in my case, some articles came out saying I did private shows at Yakuza-backed parties independently. It was all over the internet just like that. The story just got bigger and bigger, and I didn't know what to do. Every time I went outside, I'd hear people whispering behind my back. I had to retire from comedy. Know what it's like to be all over social media? Someone got 10,000 likes for saying, Mamioka's reputation's darker than he takes his coffee. Ah. With everyone seeing me through this distorted lens, I decided to move to Hawaii and start over. It sounds like you've been through a hell of a lot getting here, and through no fault of your own. I I'm sorry for the bad breaks. <laughs> That's kind of you to say, but don't worry about me. At least now all I have to worry about is whether my coffee tastes good. Let the people judge me fairly on that and I'll be fine. I mean, if there's one thing I can do, it's treat my beans well. You can taste the difference love and care makes. It's an honest living without the scrutiny of cameras and social media. I'm finally happy. <laughs> That's good. Actually, I do know what it's like to have a bunch of strangers all learn your name on social media. On the other hand, I know how great it feels to have people value the things you worked hard on. I wish you nothing but the best. Your coffee is fantastic. Mm. Thank you for everything. 
Stop by again whenever you like. Mm-hmm.